Hello guys, time again for yet another tying video. So today gonna be a pattern I haven't tied before, Jon's Guide to Norway, Toll Free. Let's begin. Let's start with this uh, fly. So I'm gonna tie in a gold tinsel in the back. First waxing the thread a bit. There we go, a few wraps. We're gonna be very, yeah, three turns, that's enough. Uh, we're gonna have um, two different color of silk. So yeah, securing this one. There we go. <clears throat> so first we're gonna have uh, let me look at the pattern pale blue everything properly so I can fish with the fly of course a few ramps back oh sorry I lost it tight wraps backwards making sure to leveling the silk as well It was not that good. Let me redo it. It's all over the place. Need to keep it tighter. States. There we go. So just gonna secure that one. Cut it off. And then we add the orange. I see I have a few strands there still. There we go. Now they're gone. <coughs> My coal is not gone yet, but almost there. Just in case I make funny noises more than usual. <laughs> so we have our orange silk. Securing a bit of it, and I'm gonna cut it off, leveling up for the tail. So just a bit more there. There we go. Just gonna add some wax to the thread. There's my wax. <clears throat> then we have the tail. If 
from the nice short bar. Center it. There we go. It's not that short, <laughs> but it, that was the whole feather, so it's not from a long one. So a bit more wax to the thread. Then we're gonna add some teal. other hopefully yeah there we go just add a bit here have ostrich turn so I'm gonna wax the thread again it's gonna be a nice it's nice colors in this pattern I like it I didn't have any uh, claret uh, pig so I'm gonna use uh, seal that's okay this one my favorite tool in the world I still haven't found my new one come on is it that dry yeah it's really dry so let's then try to do it gently with the fingers There we are. No more turns securing that one. There we are. So now it's secured. So just cutting that one off as well. the pattern so I don't miss anything. Two turns pale blue floss and so it's pig's wool. Flat gold. So I'm gonna tie in the flat gold first. Let me do the silk and then when the two turns of silk is in we're gonna add the hackle. not really gonna be two turns of silk just a little bit more just gonna back the thread to make sure the silk doesn't pull out yeah, do the turn so I'm using a, a microphone uh, so guys uh, Please uh, add in the comments if uh, the voice quality is better. And if you like it, then I'm gonna continue using it. Order a new one as well. Similar as DJI, 
the wireless when I'm out uh, fishing, or shooting videos, camping, or whatever. They're quite useful as well. Securing the silk. I can actually do a bit more. There we go. Now we're gonna have the claret cockackle. So I found uh, one of the best quality. It's an Indian cape, but but uh, yeah. They are much better than the Chinese. So I'm just going to pull down all the fibers. So called double it. Then we can tie it in. Always wax the thread before as well, so you don't pull it out. <coughs> Sorry about that. Really, I'm gonna keep that away from the seal fur I'm gonna add now. And uh, keep in mind the pattern state pig's wool, but I didn't have any. So, just removing all the. Uh, I have like a wooden spoon. Blend. Yeah. Small wooden things to dry the silver silver in. So it's gonna start small. I still wanna be able to pull out the wood. A bit. I like the bushy bodies. Yeah. I think that's the purpose of the sea wool, the pig's wool, so you can pull it out, make it the, the fly alive, so to say. bit more I like the claret bodies it's a nice color and if you like the tying videos uh, make sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out any of the, my coming videos I do uh, normal videos live videos Anything. I have a nice community as well. I try to keep it active. So I think I'm gonna stop there. Since we're gonna have a yay front tackle. There we go. So I 
Let's clean up the desk here. So, let's start with the tin cell. So, I'm just gonna have a look again. I think yeah, I'm gonna go with normal five. Yeah, securing that one and actually I'm gonna cut it off there we go I'm gonna I can pull out the wool a bit later I'll do a bit now I like it when it's a bushy fly Fighting it again. So let's add the hackle now. So uh, you tight wrap, folding the fibers backwards after the flat gold tin cell. So the hackle stem is like hidden behind the tin cell. stem and everything. I might have left a bit too much in the front but let's see how that turns out. The yay is gonna eat a lot. Really bushy. Bushy fly. So Yay. I'm gonna tie it in on the other side since I'm gonna pull the fibers so I want them to be visible. fibers here before I do anything else it's easier to manage now there we go so let's wrap this one around make sure keep it at the right position we don't want to hide these uh, nice yay feathers. We want them to be visible. I 
think that's enough. So just securing it. As you see now, uh, the head looks much nicer since the uh, the stem is quite thick, so it takes takes some volume volume. Now we can play around a bit with my nice little tool here. So just making room for the wing, folding the feathers to the side. removing any too long uh, silver hair, fiber, whatever you call it. So there we are. And we are ready to start to add uh, the wing. I just need to prepare it first. I'm playing around with the uh, I want to build the wing. I think I'm going to do it in three sections. So tying in the first one here. <coughs> in the front. So I took uh, some peacock wing, <coughs> some turkey and added the, the red. So I'm gonna do similar to the next layer, the peacock wing. Then I'm gonna go with yellow. I'm not marrying them, I put them on top of each other, like uh, stacking them. And then we're gonna have a bit more turkey. And I'm just gently brushing a bit in the top putting it aside and then doing the same on the other side peacock wing yellow want it to be the same length and then the turkey Then gently just brush a bit. And then I take both the wings and add them on top of each other. Then I'm gonna tie that one in. What I want to achieve is to have a little bit of color since the 
the majority of the fly is uh, you know not a normal color not natural color not uh, dyed or yeah whatever so I want to mix that throughout the wing instead of every, having everything at the same place at the same so I'm just playing around see if that looks good and it's not fully mixed this like built still so time for the third wing I'm just gonna cut off all the leftovers first now we're going with Florican, Corey, and we're gonna add blue. I think it's gonna look nice. So let's see if that's the case. So I put Florican on the outside, then Corey on top underneath that. And then the blue. And then some more Cory. And a bit more Cory can. Then I ask gonna brush a bit just a little bit not that uh, it goes mixed but it's like yeah still built so same on the other side just want to make sure that the the fiber length are similar length and adding the glow them up let's tie that one in as well so I'm not saying this is the way to do it but yeah I wanted to try it and see how it uh, does look on this pattern need to like work them together a bit Need something stronger. Hmm. Let's see what I got. But first, just want to make sure. Ah, not that bad. we're starting to get the look I was looking for I think you're gonna be happy with that one I'm 
Yeah, the tea lay got a bit messed up, but then no problem. So a topping on top of that, just gonna have a look. Blue and yellow maco topping, okay. So let's prepare that. Let's try to fit this uh, topping. It's not the nice one. But somehow I'm, I've washed so many necks and the outcome of that is just rubbish. For the uh, shorter ones. Don't know what's wrong with the birds today. Something like that. <clears throat> yeah, I need to eat before my live stream, so let's add the horns. Gonna let the horns go through like the middle. And manage to get them on nicely. There we are. It's okay. I'm gonna cut that one off immediately so we can add the horn. to uh, make sure everything is where it should be. Just gonna back the thread a bit more. There we go. So let's see. it that was my take on the assassin uh, yeah here it is I'm gonna make it uh, uh, look a bit nicer and I would say yeah a mess <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the video though uh, make sure to subscribe and uh, hit the bell button and so on um, see you in the next video <laughs>